Action Festival. We're starting right now, right on stage. Yeah. I'm seeing a copy of Edible Santa Barbara. Oh my God. I, it, is there anyone here who can talk about it? You know, Krista, why don't you just ad hoc a few words <laughs> you know, about it? It's funny. I Edible happen to be the publisher of Edible Santa Barbara. So Who's there the, you go. Who that's, knew? that's amazing. I'm here from last year. Okay, well. <laughs> Hi everyone, it's Krista Harris from Edible Santa Barbara and, and Alan Irwin. Oh, Santa Barbara Improv! There yes! you go! Because there's nothing like food and improv. Nothing like food. Improvising food, actually. Actually, is that's a, a specialty. Thing. That's, that's right. a thing. Yeah. Hannah Crum, aka Kombucha Mama, uh, will be sharing with us what's in your booch. Now, I love that. Booch is a thing. Booch is a thing. I never so heard nobody term. says kombucha anymore. Oh, well, you I guess have to nobody. Say booch. <laughs> booch. Yes. Right, it's well. a thing. It's a thing. And did you know that there's a kombucha lounge? But her name is right Kombucha there. Mama. Well, that's, that's true. Okay. But when we, you know, when we talk, talk about what she does, it's we booch. Can say, you know, we don't how's say booch mama. Booch, booch mama booch? doesn't sound right. No, no, but how's your booch? Okay. How's your booch? How's your booch? Yeah, there you go. You've got it. Okay, so Nothing she's, she's about coming that. up at 11.45. Now, here's the thing. We know we live in an area with a bounty of food and resources around food and health and all those elements. So, Krista, let's say I wanted to learn more about what's available in the community and, oh and maybe have God. some fun doing it as well. What? Can you think of anything going I on in this community? I am so glad you asked, Alan. So, we are meeting Edible Santa Barbara. Yep and myself are sponsoring yet another Eat Local Challenge for the month of October. Hooray! Alan, that you've participated yeah. in an Eat Local Challenge, and I want to just go on the record of blaming <laughs> you for what we are about to do this year. Because this year, oh, we are stepping got, yeah. it up a notch. Right. So we've always, we've done, oh gosh, nine years, we've done this Eat Local Challenge. And when Alan did it the other year, he said, you know, I kind of wish there was a little bit more support and a little bit more information. Understand, and... I am a, like, for me, food is how much money do I have in my wallet to go buy something? That's food for me. So the idea of Eat Local Challenge when Krista finally, like, you really, like, okay, yeah, I do want to do this and learn it. And it was incredibly hard at a personal level. I mean, there's, there's the people who do it sort of intuitively, but I kept... I, I did it, I successfully got through the month and I did everything local, you but did. it was this constant effort and I felt like I needed the support. And when I saw what you've got planned for this year, it's okay. pretty amazing. Okay, yeah. so here's what we have planned. For those of you who, you know, you're kind of on the fence, you're not sure if you should do this, you definitely want to do it this year. Yeah. We have set up a an email newsletter that you can sign up for just by going to our website. And each weekday in the month of October, you'll get an email newsletter with a project, an assignment, if you will, of something to do that's related to the Eat Local Challenge and a bunch of tips and suggestions, recipes, you name it. We're gonna have lots of information for you. We're even doing YouTube videos, so you'll get extra tips via video. Yeah. And there's gonna be a whole community around it. So you won't feel quite so alone. You won't go, where do I get cheese? You know, you'll actually have some resources. And you can do this no matter where you are. You don't have to be in Santa Barbara. You can be anywhere and do an Eat Local Challenge, and we're going to have the resources for you. So I encourage all of you to head over to EdibleSantaBarbara.com, just click the button to sign up. And I, I want to make it clear, this is not like, oh my God, like so much pressure. Krista, there's exceptions, there's oh whatever God, your yeah. mileage, like it's super easy. You can set it up at whatever level of difficulty you want. If you want a real, if you know local food and you want to get a real challenge, she's got a way you can structure that. If you're scared to death and sort of a novice at all this, there's some super easy ways of looking at it. And and so I, I really encourage you, it's if nothing else, this amazing awareness and you can learn whatever you want out of it. I, I highly recommend it. It's amazing how we can just stand up here and entertain you with no script. <laughs> yes. It's amazing. Um, some of us are professionals at it. Oh, right. That's right. <laughs> Let's Food be clear. Improv. And improv. Yeah. Hannah Crumb, because I just like saying the kombucha hand. mama. And also because I've recently learned that booch is the word I'm supposed to use now. Booch is the word. <laughs>